Hello Place is made possible by a major grant from the Corporation for Public Broadcasting and by the annual financial support of viewers like you. By using our creative energies and working together, we can all make the world a little brighter. Edison International and the Edison International family of companies. Sears. Support for the Puzzle Place is just one of the many sides of Sears. The Puzzle Place is supported by IBM. to spend another wonderful heavenly hour with Lisa. Oh, oh Lisa's a dog groomer lady. Meow, meow, meow. Oh, 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 I didn't expect you to understand, Sizzle. This is between Lisa and me. I... I love her, Sizzle. There. I've said it, and I'm glad. Hmm. See you later. <laughs> Oh, oh, but, Nuzzle, this bone is for you! Uh, you can show it yourself, Sizzle. Enjoy. Lisa! Show oh. it myself? Well, I guess somebody's got to chew it. trying to, huh? Julie, but first this thing ate me alive, <sighs> and then it collapsed in a heap. <laughs> like that. Oh. Well, you know, Leon, it's not easy putting up a tent. Tell me about it. Well, let me try. was really tired. But while I was trying to go to sleep, I kept hearing this squeaky, chirpy little noise in the tent. It sounded like it was coming from my knapsack. And I opened it, and there was the cricket. He had crawled into one of the pouches. I said, hello, Mr. Cricket. And he made that cricket sound like saying, hello, Jody. 
He was so cute that I took him home with me. And since then, he lived in my room in a special jar. But I brought him here for today. His name is Davy Cricket. I'll go get him. Wow. Yeah. There he is. Oh, right. Right. Hey, Davy, guess what? We're going camping again. Uh, 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 Davy? Davy? Um, he isn't moving. Huh? Well, usually he moves at least a little. Huh? And then he's not making any noise. No. Oh, shh, shh. Huh? Maybe he's asleep. Oh, yeah. 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 Uh, Davey, wake up, Davy. Wake up, Davy. Davy, wake up. Davy, wake up. Davy, wake up. Davy, wake up. Davy, Davy. I don't think Davy's sleeping. Huh? Um, I'm, I'm sorry to have to tell you this, but I think Davy's died. You mean he's dead? Mm-hmm. He's not alive anymore, Leon? Well, well, maybe he'll come back to life later. Like, like some plants that die in the winter come back to life in the spring, um, right? Jody, right? you see, it's, it's different with animals and insects. When they die, they don't come back to life. Jody... Everything that's alive has to die sometime. It's... it's normal. I... guess it was just Davy's time. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> Jody? <laughs> we should probably bury him. We all do it together, okay? Mm-hmm. put Davy in this little box, and uh, we dug the grave. So now we all have to say something. Well, what should we say? I know what to say. Um, now we're going to say goodbye to Davy. He was a great pet. And I really liked having him around. He always... <laughs> Jody told us how he made these great cricket sounds. She, uh... She really miss him. And, um... And... And she will always remember him. Now it's time to say goodbye. Leon? Leon, yeah. will you please? Oh. and go home. I don't think I'd be very much fun anymore. Okay. Jody's really sad because Davy died. Jody, wait! If 
you stay, then we can play hide and seek, and then you'll be having fun, and then you'll be forgetting all about Davy. Well, I'd like to stay, but I sort of don't feel like having fun. I'm sorry. Judy! Hmm. You don't have to be sorry, and, and, and you don't have to have fun, but please stay anyway. You can be as sad as you want, and we will help you. Mm -hmm. But shouldn't I just try to forget about Davy and do something else? Well, I don't think you can forget Davy, mm -hmm. but I think you feel better if you remember him. What? Huh? <laughs> yeah. Remember, because sometimes remembering something you like can make you feel better, like we do in El Día de los Muertos. My friends Jose and Mariela celebrate Día de los Muertos with their families. Talk a lot, you know about life. Mariela's aunt died two years ago, and Jose's uncle died about five years ago. Dia de los Muertos, the Day of the Dead, is the day where you celebrate the person's death. And you think of them, special things, you think of special things to do for them. On this day, we, me, we make an altar in the house. It has a cross, candles, flowers, photographs, like scenes from the memories you had with them. This day is for my uncle, Alfonso. He died when he was 67 years old. I was in third grade. When he died, I was missing something. When I would go to their house, it would be fun, but I was still missing his love, you know, the uncle love from him. Well, today I'm remembering my Aunt Martha. Um, she was my, my mother's twin sister. When I think of her, I, I feel very sad. Uh, she was very special to me. It's good to talk about the person that has passed away, especially if you were really close to them, because you shouldn't keep it all inside. You'd be really, it'd, it'd be really hard to deal with it alone. You want the chicken? The thing I remember most about him was like, he, when I used to go after school, he used to be like, how was your day? Did you read? I want you to read and be intelligent, always. You see, it's very He was fun very fun nice to me. It's very fun to, to it's read. comfortable to read with him. Oh, I remember when my aunt, when I got home from school, she would always say, did I want anything to eat? She would treat me very nice. I like yeah. that. You miss her? <laughs> yeah. You do? Yeah, I know. We all miss her. She was a nice person. Remember them. Just don't forget them. It's nice to remember. <laughs> Remembering those who have died makes people feel better. Mm. That's why I think, Judy, you should try to remember Davy, not forget him. You know, Kiki, you're right. Remembering can make you feel better. <laughs> Chinese families have a special day for that, too. It's called Qingming. Oh. Qingming is a special holiday, both in China and in the United States. It happens in the spring. People visit the graves of their relatives who have died. This family is visiting the grave of their uncle, Thomas. They bring flowers and tidy up the grave. Then they set out food that their uncle Thomas used to eat. The chopsticks and cups and money are like special pretend presents to show how important the memory of the dead person is. Then they talk about their loved one. They remember what their Uncle Thomas liked to eat and all the fun things they all did together. Alan says that his uncle taught him how to read. Alan says that his uncle taught him how to read. 
Maggie says Uncle Thomas used to take her shopping. Uh, shopping. When they're ready to go, they pick up all the things and bow to show their respect. Qingming helps us feel close to people who have died. Yeah. Uh, hey, I have an idea. What? Oh, Leon, please, w will you bring me a tablecloth? Sure. And, and Julie, uh, will you bring me some of those uh, uh, light candles? Okay. And, and and what do I need? Oh, oh, I need some flowers, so I'm going to the greenhouse. But, but Kiki, what are we going to do? Well, we are going to make an I Remember table. And I remember table? Mm-hmm. Yeah. It'd be like what my family does in El Dia de los Muertos and like Julie's family does in Ching Ming. We can use it to remember Davy and any other pets we want. So bring something that reminds you of your pet. It's okay for you, Jody? Yeah. Thanks. Okay, everybody. Meet me in uh, five minutes. Okay? Okay. okay. Sure. Yeah. Okay, okay. Oh, there. Oh, the, this will be a nice place to remember our pets. Who is that a picture of, Kiki? This picture? Oh, this picture is a picture of me and my favorite teddy bear, Mr. Bear. <laughs> I used to have really great tea parties with him, except we don't like tea. So we had pineapple juice. I think I left him on the bus one day, and I never found him. I still miss him so much. So I thought it would be nice to remember him today. So who do you want to remember, Julie? Oh, um, my goldfish, Casey. I never could figure out whether he could see me through the bowl or not. <laughs> but he was really fun to play with. I had him for a long time, but then last year he died. So I brought this fishbowl to remind me of him. Yeah, that's why I brought this cage in, to remind me of my pet hamster, Ellis. He was always finding a way to get out of this cage. Hey, there you are. I would always try to find him and then tell him to stop doing it. But you know hamsters, they never listen. Hmm. Then one day he got loose and I just never found him. So, I'd like to remember him now. Jody, would you like to remember? See, sometimes remembering something you love can make you feel better and not so sad. Well... <sighs> I don't know. I'm gonna go home and ask my dad what to do. Excuse me, Daddy, can I talk to you? Just one minute, honey. Okay. Okay. What's up? Um, well, Daddy, remember Davy, my pet cricket that I found on our camping trip? Sure. Well, today he died, and I feel really sad, and I don't know what to do. Come here, honey. Hmm. I'm sorry Davy died. Yeah. But you know, all animals die. And crickets, so they don't live as long as bigger animals do. So it was probably just Davy's time to die. Yeah, I guess. But it still makes me sad. Well, sure it does, honey. Mm. And that's fine. You 
And when something like this happens, it's perfectly okay to feel sad. Now, you don't have to pretend to be happy or anything. No? No. You know, in Jewish families, when a person dies, we do something called sitting shiva. Shiva means seven. And if we're in that person's family, we stay home for seven days. And all our friends and relatives, they come just to be with us. And they bring food, and they take care of things around the house so that those of us who are feeling sad don't have to worry about anything like that. Well, what do we do when they're visiting? Well, we feel lots of different things. We're sad, and we cry. Yeah. Or we talk about fun things that we used to do with the person who died. And maybe we even laugh. Really? Yeah, that's right. Wow. You know, your friends at the puzzle place, they can help you while you feel sad. Yeah, and you can talk about Davy and remember him and... Well, it's sort of like when we sit Shiva. Yeah. Just not for seven days, okay? <laughs> okay. I want to see you home for dinner tonight. And, you know, we can talk more about Davy then, okay? Okay. Okay. Oh, Jody. Yeah? You're going to be all right. <laughs> Thanks, Daddy. I love you. Oh. I'm so glad I can talk to you. I love you too, honey. And you can talk to me anytime. I should look. Oh, Lisa. Mm. She's so wonderful. My Lisa. Mm. Yeah. I love her. Oh. There's just one thing, though, says. What's that? <laughs> Can't stand being groomed. <laughs> so my dad said that if I had some friends around me, well, then it wouldn't be so bad. Well, then, that's what we'll do. We'll hang out with you, and you can feel whatever you want to feel. Yeah. yeah, and you can talk about whatever you want to talk about. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Daddy. Thanks. Now I think I will try to remember Davy and see what that feels like. When I think of you, I remember all the things that we did together Holding you in my hand The little games we play And all the things we used to do <laughs> When I think of you When I think of you There's a feeling It's a kind of lonely feeling Feeling that I miss you Yes, I really miss you I miss the things we used to do When I think of you I remember times when you'd sing I sat there listening And then I'd start laughing There were even times when Nothing to do but sit there and be glad When I think of you, I see blue skies I remember the brightness in your eyes Memories of my 
my friend Special thoughts with no end There's nothing that I'd rather do Than remember you Memories of my friend Special thoughts with no Kiki, you were right. When you've lost someone you love, have to be sad. Uh -huh. But it's really good to remember them. So, everybody, thanks. Thanks for helping me just by being here. <laughs> oh, you're welcome, Jody. Yes, yeah, sure. <laughs> so, um, Jody, do you want to do anything or anything? Well, I don't know. Is that camping stuff still in the greenhouse? It sure is. Shall we go camp out? Well, yeah, let's go. Okay. All right. Go Campers, ho! Okay. Um. When I think of you. is a co-production of Lancet Media New York and KCET Los Angeles. Thanks for watching The Puzzle Place today. The Puzzle Place is supported by IBM. Sears. Support for The Puzzle Place is just one of the many sides of Sears. By using our creative energies and working together, we can all make the world a little brighter. Edison International and the Edison International family of companies. The Puzzle Place is made possible by a major grant from the Corporation for Public Broadcasting and by annual financial support from viewers like you.